What's up YouTube, this is Prince with ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys my top 5 tweaks part 4. So the first one is going to be, um, let's, let's clean out everything. The first one is going to be X key. What X key does is add an extra row of keys to your keyboard. So if I want to add, if I want to go to Twitter and type something, so follow me on Twitter, ATP 101, Apple Tech Pro 101. And right here, you see, I got an extra row of keys with all these numbers. So instead of hitting that right there to get to the numbers, and when you do hit that, you get up top. You don't have to hit it again. You get the the plus, the the minus, and all that on the the number sign on the number part. When I go to the alphabet part right here, I get the numbers on top. So that's real cool. I don't have to hit the one, two, three to get to that. I could just type and put in the numbers just like that. So that's called X key, and that's the first one. And then the other one after that is called Subtle Lock. You see that right here? How my lock screen is different. It doesn't have that clutter. I got my date up here and the time in the left corner. And I could even hide some of the stuff, like notification center and all that. All that stuff I could hide. But let's open up settings and show you guys a little bit more. Let's go into settings. Scroll down. Sort of lock. So if I want to hide the camera grabber, I want to hide the date, I could hide that camera grabber right there. Where is that grabber? So I could hide that. So I could go in there, mess with the colors a little bit. I don't want to do that. But if I want to hide the grabber, the grabber, I just turn it off. And when I go back out, see the camera grabber is gone. It's not there anymore. And you see I hide the date and all that and now you only see the time in the middle so that's done with subtle lock check it out in city guys that's my second one and then my third one is eclipse if you notice how the, everything is dark so this is kinda like a night mode for your phone if the whiteness is too bright you just um, download eclipse and add it and it gives you this so even if I go to um, go on Facebook let's go on, let's go on Facebook real quick where's Facebook See, everything comes with that kind of dark, I mean, status bar and all that. Even my messages. Look at that. See all the messages. And when you scroll, you see the color changes. Like right down here, it's all, it's all like hot, like the new messages are hot. And then when it goes up, it gets colder. Like if I go up, you see right up there, it's like, I mean... It has that effect to it, so that's real cool. And let's see, yeah, that's that that's Eclipse. You, know, you could basically see everything. I go to Winter Board, where's Winter Board? You could just see the effect everywhere. You know what I mean, Twitter, all that. So that's called Eclipse, guys. Download it, run through it. It's an awesome, awesome tweak. And then my fourth one is called Quick Contacts. So if you want a speed dial on your iPhone, see that right there? I pull down and four contacts pop up. I could tap on my girlfriend right there. I could call her. I could email her. I could text her just like that. And yeah, that's called quick contacts. And you, you're wondering what happened to my search. Swipe to the right and your search box pop, pop right back up. You know what I mean, pull down. You got your quick contacts right there. Tap on it. Call. And it calls her. So just like that, that's called Quick Contacts, and that's my fourth one. And then my fifth and final one is called Tiny Bar. And what that does is for my notifications. So if my notification pop up, it's not that big notification. It's just a small little, um, it's just a small little thing. So I'm going to try to send a tweet to myself and see what happens. Let's find me. Send it from my other account, and you see that you see how small that is, and it just reads right across. That's what Tiny Bar does. It just gives you a small little notification. It's not that big thing that takes up all your screen. Just a small little thing right there, and that's what Tiny Bar does, guys. Let's go into settings, and where's Tiny Bar? There it is right here, tiny bar. You could tap on it. You could enable, disable it. 
you could have it scrolling through and that's on where it's scrolling from side to side you could show the title like who sent it I mean what app you could show the icon icon of the app and the title is the name of what app you got the um the notification from and then you could mess with the with the banner duration and all that so yeah that's tiny bar guys it's pretty cool let me show you guys another one let me send another to the test tweet let's find myself again close it out and it should be coming in any time now I don't know. Maybe it didn't send, but you see, you see, you see what this tweet does, guys. So check it out, and yeah, let me know what you guys think about it. And yeah, those are my five tweets. There it is, right there. So subscribe if you like this video. Like if you like this video. <laughs> if you like this video, and yeah, those are my top five tweaks, part four, guys. Check out my other ones. They'll be linked in the description below. And hope you guys liked it. Peace. Thanks for watching. Thank you.